and welcome once again. And in live and breaking, we start off with breaking news coming in from down south, Karnataka. The political wars are continuing to intensify in the state that between the JDS and Prala Joshi this time around. The JDS has attacked Union Minister Prala Joshi, making corruption allegations against him now. Prala Joshi hit back at the JDS, saying the allegations are being made to mislead the public. So HD Kumarasamy led the JDS now, as you see in those visuals, targeting Prala Joshi once again. The comments coming just a day after those uh, shocking remarks about uh, being a Brahmin uh, that we had heard uh, Kumarasamy say. Let's go across uh, to my colleague uh, Prala jo uh, to my colleague uh, Prajwal to get uh, uh, to get all the details on this latest uh, outburst between the two. Prajwal, it's over to you to take our viewers through this latest war of words. Uh, now, uh, Rukma, looking at this uh, entire uh, scenario, it was uh, former uh, Chief Minister H.D. Kumar Swami who started uh, hitting out uh, against uh, Prala Joshi, mainly making uh, remarks about his uh, DNA, that he's a face for Brahmin, and face for Brahmins were uh, responsible uh, for going on and destroying the Shringeri Mutt. And uh, after the JDS uh, received a lot of uh, backlash, uh, H.D. Kumar Swami then went on to apologize and uh, state that uh, he his intention was uh, not uh, meant to go on and insult uh, the Brahmins, but it was only the DNA of uh, uh, Prala Joshi that, that he was targeting from because he hails uh, from the face of Brahmin community and they have always uh, believed in division and destruction. This is the sort of clarification that came in from HT Kumar Swami. But now the JDS has gone on to make allegations, corruption allegations against uh, the union minister by releasing the letter which uh, goes on and states uh, that there was a recommendation which was given by the union minister's uh, office uh, for a doctor from uh, Shimoga to be included into the National Medical Commission and also the committee of the All India Institute of Medical Sciences. And therefore, Prala Joshi has now... A that uh, documents that are being so, Prajwal, there. Right, uh, Prajwal, please uh, continue. You were telling us uh, in detail about what the allegations are that Kumarasamy has now leveled against Prala Joshi in his latest attack. Uh, yes, so JDS MLC, JDS MLC, Bhujay Gowda released a document stating that there was a recommendation by the office of uh, uh, the union uh, minister, Prala uh, where they had recommended a person's name from Shumoga to be included into the NMC and the All India Institute of Medical Science. But now a document has been released by Prala Joshi's uh, office, uh, which uh, shows the original copy, which was uh, dated back to 2021. And uh, it clearly shows uh, that uh, there was no relation uh, uh, relation between the document which was given by the JDS and these are baseless. And the union minister would go on to file a defamation case against S.P. Kumar Swami and the JDS party as well. Over to you, Rukma. Well, many thanks, Prajwal, uh, for that quick update uh, and for giving us all those details, uh, bringing us up to speed on this latest war of words uh, between uh, H.D. Kumarasamy, who's now levelled new allegations against uh, Union Minister Prahlad Joshi. We'll be keeping track of that story. Many thanks, Prajwal, for joining us.